What is your take on like texting? Like, if you text somebody, how long are they supposed to? How fast are they supposed to text you back? And like, when do you leave the conversation? And what's the etiquette? How do you feel about that? Is this is this like just in general, or is this like if you're talking to someone that you're attracted to? Like, what is who both. am I texting? Both. So let's go with somebody you're attracted to. If I'm much. I don't really care for how long I need to wait or (laughs) how long, like, I don't care. I just, if I see the text, I'm going to text it. I'm joking. (laughs) (laughs) It'll come my album. There's a hair on it. Yeah, don't eat it. Ew. Um, yeah, no, I don't, I don't care about the wait time. I don't think there should be a specific wait time. If I see the text and I have something to say back, then I'll just text it right away. Do you say your whole feeling? Um, usually, yeah. I don't, well, what do you mean? What do you mean by that, though? I mean, if you love the person, Uh you're just going to say it first? Wait, I thought we were just talking. (laughs) What happened? No, I'm not going to tell them right away that I love them. <laughs> no, I mean like when you do love them. Like let's say like it's like five months in or whatever. Oh, I don't know how long you're supposed to say I love you. <laughs> <laughs> how, how long are you supposed to say I love you? Do you is it three days? That's too short, right? No, that's way too short. Hey. What if you talk for 14 hours straight for three days? <laughs> no. Okay. Three weeks? Still short? I think it's still short. Okay. Three months? Okay. But, you know, I don't really think there's like a time frame. That's what the fuck I'm saying. <laughs> so three days is too short? That's the time frame. Yeah. But, like, you're, how are you going to know that you love someone within three you days? for 14 hours straight. You went to meet their family? No, no. That's crazy. Why? Did you did you fall in love in three days? You're I such a liar. <laughs> Okay. You're a liar. Yeah. It's the love at first sight. I looked at her, I go, I love you. <laughs> How did she respond? I go, I love you. <laughs> She's like this. Okay. <laughs> dude, dude, this fucking car is stuck on teeth. Dude, it's stuck everywhere. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> All right. Um, but <laughs> what's it called? I'm trying to get this. So. Yeah, so uh, fucking... Okay, so then what's the time for... So three days is too short. So three weeks? No, I told you there's no time frame. Then why is three days too short? That's a time frame. You said there's no time frame. I just gave you a time frame. You said there's no time frame. (laughs) But for me, I don't think I could fall in love with someone within three days. But you talk for 14 hours straight. You know everything, almost everything about this person. When you go on a date, that's what? Two hours? Right, if you, if you don't even like have a connection with the person, two hours is nothing. Because two hours is like, oh, where are you from? Like, there's just a little things. But if you connect with somebody, mm-hmm. two hours, three hours is a lot. So you, you know how sometimes like one of your best friends, you can you connect with them instantly. Like they get you, you know, sure. they get your humor, they get your like background with a Korean family or whatever the thing is. Immediately you connect, and if you talk for like three, four days or whatever. But what if they're like a. Like a, yeah, exactly. Like, yeah, I know. And then you have three <laughs> days, and you're just gonna fall in love with him, and you find out later on that he's just like. Okay. Crazy. Anyway. Okay. <laughs> you get it? <laughs> I got it. Zoom in on it. I got it. Mmm. <laughs> Delicious. I'm glad. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> um. Yeah. What did the. the Okay, so okay, fine. It we'll just skip that. There's no time frame, but three days is too short. But that's a time frame. So, anyways, <laughs> three days too short. Do you tell somebody you love them when you love them, though? Yeah, I think even though if you have to say it first. Oh, if I have to say it first, I don't know. What's the problem? What's the goddamn problem? 
It if depends. you love somebody, you can't it, fucking tell them. No, 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 it depends on like the the atmosphere, you know. If we're like in a in a loving state right now, you know. What do you mean? Just like if the atmosphere is very lovey dovey, and then if my emotions like take over, then maybe I will. I'll just be like, you know what? I really, really like you. <laughs> <laughs> What do you mean I really, really like you? You didn't even say I love you. What the fuck you mean? I really, really like you. And then it, it inches towards that, you know? Just to feel feel it out. What, okay, what if he's like, I really, really like you too? There, there, that's it. That's, that's where we're going to go. <laughs> what? What do you mean? But you don't really, really like him. You love him. Okay, I think I would say it. I would say it. Why, why does it have to be like a romantic setting? Why can't it just be like, like, you know, out of nowhere? Like you're just feeling it, but he's, you know, he's like maybe cutting a watermelon <laughs> or whatever he's doing. He's like watching TV. He's picking his boogers <laughs> or whatever the thing that he's doing. But you love him. You, you would, because you're reminiscing. You're going through all the positive things that he does. Right. You know, and all these things, and you just feel like a urge of emotions, like a wave of emotions. Like, man, I love how he, even though he's picking his boogers and Carly Watermelon or like eating ice cream, you just like how he's doing those things. And you just go, oh, fuck, I fucking love this guy. Like, you said it to, to yourself already. Huh. Okay. Then, then, yeah, I would probably say it. I would probably say it. Because if I'm feeling that, like, that's strong, why you're single. <laughs> you're not supposed to say it. You hold it in until he says it. You pussy. You might be right. You might be right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You, you. I, I, I'm a firm believer of if, if that's how you feel, you say that shit. Oh, okay. Because oh. regardless, it's like because if something happened to you or whatever happens, you know, you don't know. Maybe he goes out and 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 find another, like met another woman or whatever. But why would I want to say that if he's going to change so... No, not change so... It's just like... It maybe it's still early on in a relationship, like three weeks in. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? And then you just felt super connected with this person. But maybe that day, he connected super well with this other person. But because you said I love you to him before he went out to the grocery store, he might be feeling some type of way now so that when he, met, he, he meets this other woman, he's like, yeah, he feels nothing. Because he just overwhelmed and like embracing your the fact that you told him that you love them okay do you know what i mean i get it yeah like that could be a thing it doesn't have to be a thing <laughs> but that could be a scenario there's some drama yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah but the, no but the, that's the thing like if you didn't tell them maybe in his head he still has like a oh i don't i'm not sure if she loves me maybe we're just having a good time but if you solidify that like hey i love you regardless if you love me or not regardless if he say it back to you maybe he doesn't say it back to you maybe he's like do i love her and then he has his way to the grocery store some bitch is like hey uh whatever look at my titties i don't know what people say i don't know what people say but if if you didn't say it to him, maybe he just focused on another thing now. Do you know what I mean? But maybe because you did say it, now it's like, oh my god, like I think I love her too, you know, or whatever. Now he, I don't know. Maybe maybe that's the thing. But um, okay, three days. Uh, so what about the text? What what about the text? So let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. If you're texting with somebody, having a full conversation, right? Uh huh. D- I'm just going to tell you how I feel first, okay? If we're texting and it's going back and forth, back and forth, right? And you somehow go like, hey, I'm at work, right? Uh-huh. But So I can't talk on the phone, right? That's what we're texting. Because I, I, personally, I don't like texting. Yeah. Because I just, I just, it's just much more efficient to just say things quicker, you know, and the connection and the intonation, you know, the nuance of the, communicating through speech you know uh i don't like it if we're texting and i say like a fucking five texts or one paragraph and you say nothing did you hear me yeah yeah yeah. so you would you would text them a five page or no no just like whatever just like a sentence or two sentences and they don't text you back yeah and they don't text you back I'm like, what the fuck happened? This is what the fuck I'm talking about. 
Why would you not text me back? Say, hey, gotta go. Anything. Bye. Uh, like, do you, do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You, like mid-conversation, right? Mid-conversation, mid-conversation. This is the thing. If you do this once, twice, uh-huh. I get it. Shit happens in life. Maybe you hit a car, you know. May- maybe you were angry at somebody. You got distracted. Maybe you got to go back to work real quick. Maybe, you know, maybe your baby's crying. Maybe your your grandmother slipped. You got to catch her. You do this every single time? Go fuck yourself. Really? That bothers you? So much. <laughs> it doesn't bother me. I don't know. I, I like... If we're mid conversation, then I'm like. Okay, let me ask you something. What if it's somebody you like, somebody you love? Uh, well, friends wise, like. No, not friends wise. No, not friends. No, wise. like, so like. It doesn't matter with friends. Huh? It doesn't matter to you with friends. Somebody you like. Somebody, is like, is like that. Your three third three week boyfriend. Yeah, I wouldn't like it. I wouldn't like it, but then I would like rationalize it. Okay, like, let me ask you something. R- okay, this person, you you go like this. You go you you're having a conversation, and it's um he asks you a question. I don't know what he would ask. He's whatever the question may be. Like, oh, how are you feeling these days? Just some general stuff. Okay. How you? But this is in the middle. Like you guys talk about the day, like your career, whatever. And he goes, "Oh, so but how are you? How are you feeling?" And then you, you have several things to a career answer, and then you have an answer for how your relationship is, mm-hmm. right? Like how how your relationship, how you feel about him. Oh, okay. Right. Uh-huh. So, but you want to update him on your career as well. Uh, right. So you give him two things, right? Huh? He comes back with nothing. You go, hey, you know, I've been doing good. I've been working with Jason, and you know, he's been abusing me, <laughs> 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 and what, whatever the things that you say. But sometimes it's stressful. Sometimes I actually love Jason. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, skip it. <laughs> um, so whatever you say, uh-huh. and then after the thing. He says nothing. How long does it take him for to not to reply back? Is there ever a reply? Yeah, no. You, you're texting him, right? And he's replying one after another. You go, "What's your favorite color?" He goes, right, right. "Saffron." But I'm saying, like, after I text him that, and then he doesn't respond. Yeah. How long does it take him to respond later? Twelve hours. <laughs> Goddamn. <laughs> Twelve hours. Would you be okay with that? Maybe the first time, yeah. Maybe no. Every time, time. Called, every, every time, every time, every time he leaves on his terms. Okay, no. Then, then there's an issue. Yeah, I would, I would, I would hate that. Because what the fuck is the problem? <laughs> this is the thing. Say a word. Buy anything. Right. Am I wrong? I'm busy. Yeah. I'm busy. Or I'm sleeping now. Or. I gotta take. I gotta use the powders room, or just a period, or like a hand. Bye. Uh-huh. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Am I wrong? No, no. You're, you're. I, I, I think so too. So, so there's. So let me ask you. So there's a two different categories. So if it's with friends, you don't care, right? Yeah, with friends, I don't care. But okay. I agree with you. I don't right? give a fuck. But if somebody you love, like a family member, uh-huh. like mom. If you text her and every time you you have a conversation with her, and then she just disappears, the fuck are you doing? But it's a little different no, because if my if I'm talking to my mother, she goes, "How's your day?" I go, "Good," uh-huh. and then she's like, "How's your career?" I tell her, "Good." How's your wife? And then I tell her, uh-huh. and she's gone. She's like, "How's your wife?" I really want to know. How's everything going? I tell her, and she leaves. Uh huh. What if I'm like, oh, she's doing great. You know, her health is good. You know, we're going through uh, some things. And then, but now she's feeling better. You know, oh, by the way, I, I, I have some questions. Like, do you think like this color would be good for the stroller? Or like, 
so you have follow-up questions i have follow-up questions okay there's follow-up questions there's like four questions like uh -huh. like uh oh and you know would it be okay if you know you, you help us out like come come see the baby you know whatever the thing is whatever the thing is right follow-up questions mom just no text for 13 hours where'd you go what did you you can't just say bye you can't type b y e you can't do that when you're texting fucking am i wrong somebody that you have a close relationship with and then you do this shit every time yeah i can see that am i wrong like who who in their right mind because it's like you know how that feels that's like if you're hungry right because uh -huh. you're in you're connected with your food you're having a good time and then imagine this imagine <laughs> imagine this you're you're eating oh my god you're so hungry right you're having a great time eating honey habanero chicken wings and you're like oh this chicken wings so good i eat it oh and then you pick up the second one oh man like i'm salivating this is so good i take a sip of water i come back with a chicken wing and then you take a bite and the dude just snatches your fucking wing out of your mouth and then takes your wings out you're like wait but i'm still hungry you know i was in the middle of the wing how come there's no more meat and then 12 hours later they're like hey look these are the chicken wings that you like Because I'm enjoying the fucking thing and you snatch my food away? That's like, I'm talking to you in a conversation because it's a linear, it's like, a, I'm expecting to finish. That's like if I finish the wing and you go, hey man, can I have some wings? Yeah, take it. Let's share. You just take my wing away from my mouth and go, no, fuck your wing. What? I'm still eating the wing. I was expecting to finish the wing. That's like the conversation. I was expecting to finish the conversation. But if you go, if I take a bite and you go, hey, can I get a bite? I mean, yeah, a little weird, but okay. I will still be okay with that. Does that not make sense? No, it makes sense. Yeah. Tell me I'm crazy. No. Tell me my, my feeling isn't normal in the norm of society. Yeah, I would say it's true. I think everybody would feel upset most people most humans right right <sighs> motherfucker okay go ahead <laughs> do you have anything to add on the texting thing on the texting thing no oh well okay because like you're so you're you were basically saying though on the fall it's a follow-up question that you have that yeah not if, if, if somebody has a question and go Get back to you later. Because right, right. the thing is, if you didn't, this is real quick. Uh -huh. The thing is, like, if we are already talking, that means you have some time. And if you got to go by. But if you do this, I'm saying if you do this every single time or every other time, like, then that's a weird thing. If you're busy and then you you just do be, being short with me, I totally get it. Because it's like, I know you're busy. Yeah. But then if you're... N <laughs> my cholesterol is rising as we... My, my okay, arteries okay. getting but, clogged. But go let ahead. Me, let me just say... So, like, let's say you don't have a follow-up question, but yeah. you were, like, going back and forth, back and forth, uh, texting each other, and then you just answer their question, and they don't say anything back after you just answer. You don't ask them a question. That's back. fine. That's fine. They could just leave. Yeah. No, they don't need to say bye or anything they, like that. They, so, they, if they're like, hey, what color is your backpack? Uh -huh. I go gray. Uh -huh. Nothing? Cool. Bye. Oh, so it doesn't matter on it that doesn't ma because only, it's like Only if you ask a question. Well, only if you ask a question or like if we're talking like a, if we're having a full conversation, like sentences, uh -huh. not like just like when we're meeting nine, like nothing short like that. It's like what happened to your sister's backpack? Like and then I'm telling you the story and you're like, oh, my God. And, you know, Texas, this happened. Uh -huh. And then I'm like, yeah, in Texas. And then she, you go um yeah she's you know was in a restaurant like you're you're asking me these things and then you're like uh oh wow like my uh colleague also got robbed or whatever so if you're doing like a full conversation you're adding you're asking questions if it's a full conversation <laughs> and then i say a thing 
It's like if I'm watching a movie and you just turn it off. Well, who's got who's got the remote control? God damn it! Turn it back on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, but like, let's say it's just a whole conversation you're having, but at yeah. the end, like. Does it matter the way they end it? No, it doesn't matter the way they end it, but it's always a little bit weird because I rarely have a full-on conversation through text right. th- because of this reason. It's like, if you're busy, go fuck off, be busy. But if you have some time, let's just be on the phone. And I understand not everybody could be on the phone all the time. But that's why sometimes we do have full conversations on, on, on text just real quick. Uh-huh. Um, but if, if, if it was like, oh, wow, that sucks. Uh, but even if you go, oh, wow, that sucks, I go... Yeah, you know, talk to you later. I'll say something. I'll go talk to you later. Or you say fucking, um, yeah, you know. Or I know it's a weird thing how to end texts yeah. because it's like in the ether now. It's like, uh, is this ended? Right, right, right? right. But you know, but you wouldn't end it at in the middle of the story. You would end it like, you know, I would say like, yeah, and she, then she got her backpack back or whatever the thing is. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. And then you, you, and if they don't just respond after that, that's completely cool. Yeah, that's fine. Because we, we know this is where else we're gonna t- to go with it. You know what I mean? Then I completely agree. Yeah. No, it would suck if you ask a question and then they leave you after they just don't want to answer that one last question or what. If you are doing this out there right now, if somebody is, if you're texting somebody and you're just leaving, you should turn yourself in into the police station. That's a that's a that's a full on crime right there. That's a mental fuck. You just fucked somebody mentally. That's like that's that's why that always an equivalent of the wings thing. You just took my wings out of my mouth and you're like, yeah, I'm gonna go about my day now. No, come back here, cause now we have a problem. All right. Do you have anything to add? No. Text right. <laughs> Do the text right. Thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of Before You Die. Don't die. All right. Bye-bye.